My name's Lily Hesrek. My name's Taylor. And we're here to do some blood spatter. We're going to tell you about our PPE. We have safety glasses and lab coat and toe covered shoes. We tape down the paper so it won't blow away. And we use vampire blood for a uh, blood spatter. And we use a container and a pipette. All right, now these girls are gonna start collecting some data. So one partner will be uh, doing the droplets while the other partner records on the paper. So oh, hold that over by me, will you, Taylor? Okay. Okay, so we're starting with some low droplets. Lily, what height are you at? 20. 20, and that one has an air bubble, so let's try another 20. So you wanna hold your pipette near your meter stick, where, you, but not so close that it gets blood all over it like this one sometimes has. Oh, there we got a good one, but it overlapped, so let's move it over. Let's try another 20. And when we get a really good 20, then Taylor's gonna mark the paper. Nice, that was a great 20. So Taylor, get down there and mark the paper. Yeah, you could just lay that down. And Taylor's gonna record the height. Excellent, now try a different height. Was one of those a good 40? Yeah. The bigger yeah. one? The smaller one was a good 40? Uh-huh, because that one had a bubble. Okay. Now Taylor, maybe draw an arrow to the one she thinks is the good one. I think it's the in-between. Yeah, it's that one. Okay. Okay, now we have 20 labeled droplets of blood splatter. I think we're ready for the next part of the lab. So you will have to let your blood spatter dry a bit before you measure it. At least a few hours overnight is awesome. And if you can't do this blood spatter experiment yourself, then go to the description of this video <laughs> and you will see a link to a Google Doc of some blood spatter we did. Will you flip it around there, Taylor? Yep. Other way, there we go. So you'll see a link to a Google Doc with some real blood spatter that you can measure and analyze. And the second video after this one will tell you exactly how to measure it and graph it and interpret unknown blood spatter. Mm -hmm. Thanks for watching.